Hello guys and welcome back today to another brand new video and today we are going to be making doing episode 4 of Pac-Man and today in today's episode we are going to be making the score and the lives. If you have been enjoying the previous series leave a like down below for this video and those videos and hit the subscribe button for more coding videos in the future and yeah let's move right into it. So if you have been following the tutorial we are at the point where we have let me just show you we have the pac-man with all the food scattered around and it respawns for now um away but with no scoring system no lions hit living system and you can like go past the barriers whenever you want and we don't want that so that's what we're gonna fix in this episode and yeah let's get right into it the first thing we want to do is import the module time we will need this for the later part of this video. So import time alongside of turtle and random. And we need to make two variables and this is lives. We're going to set it to three to start off with. You can change this to whatever you want. You can do it five or 10 or whatever. And score is equal to zero. So you start with a score of zero. Now. To write the stuff on the screen, we need to make another turtle. Everything in Python Turtle is pretty much making a new turtle. So we want to make a pen turtle. So turtle dot turtle pen dot animation speed zero, the fastest. Pen dot color, we're going to do blue. Okay, you can do this whatever you want. Now pen dot pen up, I know we're going to write, but before we move it to the position. We don't want it to draw a line moving towards a position. That makes sense. Now pen dot go to, I had done the course, found the coordinates before this video, 240, 0 to 245 has been the best. Now pen dot pen down, because we do want to write. Pen dot write, so as simple as that. Now we just want to put what we want to write. We're going to do score, colon, space, and then pay attention to this curly brackets and then leave two spaces lives colon space curly brackets and then end that there you'll see why in a second because we're going to use a dot format and then we're going to put in here score the variable score and the variable lives so what this dot format does is put the score variable into this set of curly brackets, the lies variable into the second set of curly brackets to make it easy so we can update the score. Now, to make everything look nice, we want to align the text center, no uh, no capital on the C. Now we want to make the font, I always like equals brackets. Speech mark, I always use to like, I always like using courier is simple and nice 36 size 36 and then now we want to put two brackets at the end to close this bracket as well and these right so now we just want to do pen dot hide turtle so the actual turtle like sprite doesn't show up now let's just see what that looks like for now there you go guys See, look, if we eat the food, the score doesn't go up because we've not set that in the while the while true loop, the main game loop, but we will do that right now. Let's get into it. Now, now what we want to do is make border collisions. So you can't go past the border. So we want to do if pacman dot x core is more than 300 or pacman dot x core is less than minus 300 remember to use the right operators less than more than with minus and positive or pack now we do it the same for the y core pacman dot y core more than 300 or pacman dot y core less than minus 300 and we're going to put code on here we're going to do lives minus equals one and that just takes away three well takes away one from three and then makes that the new variable so it will be two 
and then we want to do pen dot clear clear it we can just copy and paste this line here copy and paste that line there put it in so it updates the lives and it doesn't say zero still now we want to use a time module time dot sleep one second that's in seconds and then pacman dot go to zero zero now we can check that now see if it's working so you shouldn't be able to go past the barriers the score still not working but you shouldn't be able to go past the barriers and yeah and you spawn back in the middle there we go and let's just i'm going to just show you what happens now so we get to zero and then we've not like nothing's reset we can go to minus and everything we're going to fix that now we want to make another big if statement so just if no whoops check lives here now make make sure the indent is correct if lives is equal is equal to zero so they've hit zero lives score is going to be reset to zero lives is going to be reset to three and then we want to just copy and paste this so we can update that again update the text and then time got sleep one second and then pacman dot go to whoop, zero zero back to the center All right now we just want to hear where we collect the food food and pacman collision we did this in the last episode we, all we want to do is do score plus equals one and then put pop this in here to update the score the score text get that indent right and now everything should be working really good so so you let the score updates the food's kind of in the way but yeah seven eight nine we can show you what happens when we get to zero lives here so one life and then zero lives zero lives score resets time sleep for one and then we are back at the beginning so this episode has been how to do score lives hope you guys have enjoyed this episode i just want to say a few things sorry for not uploading in the last two weeks just been busy with school stuff and other stuff and for Christmas and New Year. And I do want to ask you guys if you want to see in the for my next couple of videos, dev vlogs for me making um my games that I'm publishing mobile. And in fact I do have one game published on mobile and that is called Rocket Glide. It's on iOS and Google Play Store. I'll leave the link down below in the description for you to access that if you would like to play. And yeah make sure to hit the subscribe button and the like button and i'll see you guys next time peace